guys welcome back to dismantled Ooh, uh okay didn't expect to see you here but that's fine on our way out to unlock one of these other relay towers i have leveled up to level eight i got enough material to upgrade the crowbar i'm still trying to find some more ceramics so i can upgrade the machete i should stop gathering things because um i'm not anywhere near a fireplace that i know of Ooh, uh there's a building here though is there a fireplace here fireplace fireplace anywhere before I dismantle this stuff here, oh, 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 fireplace, fireplace. That works out really well for me. Go ahead and unload some of the stuff. I don't want to upgrade anything as of yet because I want to make sure I have some ceramics to upgrade the machete, the crowbar. I would really love to upgrade the backpack as well. Back online, making good progress. Yep, uh, but that's leather and I've tried to kill some deer. I've tried. And it's just not working out for me. I get like one hit in and that is it. This would make a nice little camping area. I would say that. Right next to a dock. And yeah, see those little ripples in the gr in the ground? Yeah, in the water. I assume that's for fish. Can I machete that? No, I cannot. Uh, let's take out the beautiful little bush. Why not? All right. Can I go into this building, please? Or is it going to be lockpicks? I've run into a couple buildings. Yeah, lockpicks, lockpicks, lockpicks. And I can't get in there. I see ceramics in there. It's like... Let me in. Little pig, little pig, let me in. I won't. So, um, yeah, I am level 8. I don't can't remember if that unlocks lockpicks or not. Can I search that? No, I cannot. Um, let's get the machete out first. <gasps> the door opens. All right. Tell me that is a piece of ceramic on that table that I can get. Ceramic. Hooray. Can upgrade the machete. My crowbar. Not the backpack yet, but hopefully level 8 will allow us to maybe get some range weapons. So I can maybe start taking out the deer a little bit better. Uh, can I do the toilet now? No, I cannot. Uh, what, is, what the heck is that thing over there? Don't know, but let's demolish that. Nope, can't demolish that. Alright, um, okay, can I come in here? No, that's cooking. Don't need to cook. Gather up a whole bunch of stuff. Can I search that, please? Uh, oh, potatoes. Mmm, potatoes. Lovely, lovely potatoes. Uh, yeah, let's smack up these beds because I think it gets me fabric. Uh, yeah, my backpack is full. But the good thing is we're right next to the fireplace so I can unload some of this stuff. I'll just go ahead and demolish it. All right. So, since I'm kind of curious of what level 8 does, let's go ahead and demolish these beds and go back to the fireplace. Things will respawn. Now, I know once we get to, like, the level 11, that's, like, the key thing, right? Because I think level 11 will uh, not let the zombies respawn. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing to do. The reason being is you do get material from them. So, having them respawn and be able to get material from them is pretty good. All right, let's go into the campfire. Uh... Yep, uh, plus 50% hit points regained by eating. That is good. Uh, max hit points by 5. Total effect, if you pick this, uh, I'll have 20 hit points. Uh, choose between 4 skills instead of 3 when leveling up. I have a hard enough time deciding what I want now. But I think uh, eating, plus 50% hit points regained while eating, is a good thing. Because I'd rather not go back to the fireplace right now. And have monsters respawn because some is kind of difficult to take out. Um, what have we unlocked? <gasps> the compass? Oh, that takes ceramics. Not many though. Not many. Uh, the compass will allow me to fast travel. I kind of like that. It's only three ceramics. It kind of sucks, but um, let's go ahead. Yeah, enables fast travel from one activation link to tower to another. I do like that. Uh, link tower. You know, basic basic lock picks is eleven. Uh, cooking stand. Ceramics. Ceramics, ceramics, ceramics. Uh, fishing rod, I know of. Uh, what does this do? Uh, I need some hide, whatever it is. 25% enemy view range, so I can get closer. Block 7.5 of damage received. I do like that. Mm, but I need some hide. I think hide is going to be kind of the thing I need to look for today. Uh, coffee thermos? I forgot what that does. Infuses one with extra energy and buzz. Uh, running speed. Uh, I don't really see what's going to come in handy. The flashlight, I, I'm going to have to unlock it because it doesn't, I can't see what this is. Uh, that is locked. 
Um, yeah, let's go ahead and craft it. It's, it's, some, it's plastics, which is not too much. It's scrap electronics. Whatever. Uh, monster lure? The lure emits a scent that is near irresistible to the monsters. Uses four. Fabric, plastic, and plant matter. Well, let's go ahead and craft that. I mean, I got the material for it. Scrap fabric, plastic, and plant matter is not that hard to come by. Uh, you craft another special... You can equip multiple special items and quickly switch between them by pressing the 2 button. Uh, the lure emits a scent. Yeah, drop lure and aiming. All right. Uh, camo netting. What does that do? Mesh netting made to resemble foliage. Useful for hiding one's presence. It reduces... Um, your view range, well, reduces, reduces the view range of the uh, the monsters. I guess I just call them monsters, so I guess I'll start calling them monsters. Uh, that's fabric. I don't have any fabric there. Um, Painkillers. Well, honestly enough, I got mushrooms and tons of plastic. Offers quick relief from minor pain and soreness. I don't know what that really is. I mean, it's not re it's not like I get hit and re replenishes hit points. It's, it's for soreness and pain so I don't let's go ahead and craft it I got mushrooms I got the plastic we're just using everything um oh it says right there restores 10 hit points all right two uses on that uh bandages um used to bind up wounds takes a long time to apply uses are replenished at camp well since we're building a whole bunch of stuff let's go ahead a uh, restore 50 percent maximum hit points I should be able to definitely restore a lot of my hit points <laughs> while I'm doing things. Uh, so the coffee thermos, yeah, I could quote-unquote make that. It says I can. Plastic and scrap metal, I got plenty of it. Uh, but the next couple things are there, are level 9 and so on and so forth. Uh, level 9 is going to be kind of crucial because that does unlock a few things in the throwable category. Um, fishing rod. That's just plant matter and scrap wood. And since we're kind of near a fishing area used to catch fish best used near water all right and what does that unlock uh not available level 10 i'm just I, i'm crafting a lot more than i thought it would i may not be able to upgrade my crowbar and machete right now but that's fine we got to unlock a whole bunch of stuff um yeah i, I can't craft a sleeping bag yet right hang on a second where's the sleeping bag Sleeping bag. Oh, yeah, I need to do the cooking stand, which is ceramics. Yeah, I'm very low on ceramics, which kind of sucks. Uh, upgrade gear. Can I upgrade anything? Uh, the backpack, no. Crowbar. Crowbar I can. Machete. Yeah, I'm a little low on, on that, but let's go ahead and upgrade the crowbar, because why wouldn't you? Um, increases damage from 24 to 28. Yeah, you still got to upgrade both, because there's some things the machete can't demolish, and some things the crowbar can, and vice versa, so it's good to have all that. Look at all the things I got in here now. A whole bunch of stuff. A whole bunch of stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and leave. Uh, oh, yeah. Some XP is very good. Uh, okay, so now if I go to my inventory, where does the fishing rod go? Okay, so not there. Uh, trinkets? Okay. Uh, how about this? Uh, okay. Um, let's. I haven't found the use for the shovel yet. All right, so now we got the fishing rod. Let's go ahead and now just wait until it bites. It bites, all right. How do I know when it bites? Oh, you don't have to do anything. All right, so I'll just sit here. I think if I catch five fish, I'll get some more XP. That'd be good. Well, the fifth fish is came out as a red fish, so there's different types of fish. That's pretty cool. I didn't, wasn't expecting that. Oh, look at the XP coming. Is, or is it because I'm getting getting more experience from fishing? Maybe I'm a better fisherman? Nope, there are different types of fish. So once you start fishing, don't have to do nothing. I'm not pressing my mouse keys, my keyboard to sit there and fish. I mean, basically you can sit here if you want to level up. Make the fishing pole, find a nice little fishing area, let the game fish for you. Nothing I've seen have caught all the fish. Th okay. So, no. Uh, nope, wrong button. Stop fishing. Alright, so yeah, you can. it's not going to be unlimited fish. Uh, hard to find and distracted. Uh, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and put those on in there. Common fish, yep, we found that. And let's go to the machete. Is there a, was there a stove in this building? I haven't even got 
Oh, that's right. You respawned. All right. Yeah, I kind of forgot that. Let's go to the stove and see if I learned any recipes. Uh, no, I have not. Now, I wonder if I just put like a fish and tomato in. So I can eat. It's not a recipe. I don't know how you learn recipes. I mean, does it, once you just gather stuff, does it like, oh, you know, you know a recipe. I think I'm a long ways away from the farm to do that. Uh, let's see. Let's try an egg and an onion. Does that do anything? Wait, wait, wait. Uh, let me try. No. I think it, I think it's only recipes that you know over here. I don't think you have to learn. I don't think I can learn them myself. Uh, potato and corn sounds good. All right. I guess it only matters if you have them over here. I gotta find more tomatoes so I can plant some. But as we learned, well, I tried to make another uh, corn cob and get more um, HP. It would allow me to do so. So that kind of kind of sucks. No, can you? There we go. So, I'm going to be kind of interested to see, although a couple of you have said when I play at nighttime, it doesn't get dark on the YouTube videos, which is good, and I didn't see where it was getting dark either. I really don't know what the flashlight is really good for other than, yeah, craft it so you can learn to do other things. But now I'm just going to go ahead and, of course, hoard everything. But man, we need to, I need to find ceramics. Can I damage it with the crowbar? What's my crowbar damage up to? I forgot now. 24? 24 sounds good. Uh, that needs to be 35. But we're unlocking the relays, which is good. I, I'm still, even though I've played, I, I forgot how much, i uh, played like maybe 10 hours of this game. Well, maybe not 10 hours. The camera angle, I still just can't get used to it. I just can't get used to how it works. I mean, I know how it works, but I just don't like the, the viewing angle that they have. So, I don't know if they'll give us more options as they progress in updating the game as it goes along. But, it's too much on top of the player, if that makes any sense. I like to yeah, angle it down a little bit more like that. I like to go a little bit more this way. I'm going to go ahead and throw that stuff away. Throw that stuff away? I'm not throwing it away. I'm just storing it. Um, while we're here, let's go ahead and see what this is all about. Uh, fish should still be safe to eat. Try and catch a few for the cooking. Event and craft. Fishing rod. Catch three fish. Well, we've kind of done that. Does it, do I have to catch three more fish? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Um, but right now, we see no ripples here. So, I don't know... You know what, since, I, since I've only killed one monster since we respawned, let's go to the campfire. If I sit down at the campfire. Alright, let's go ahead and leave the campfire. Do the fish respawn? No, nah, that'd be too, that'd be too simple. That'd be too simple. Alright, let's check the map to see where the heck I am. Alright, so this is our original spot right here. Uh, you can see all the campfires I have found. But I didn't really ex explore this area, did I? No. Uh, the other two relays I ne need to get to are over here. Now, the one place I really need to go to, I'm going to mark it right here. Remember, there are monsters here, and I can't open this gate. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's going to be monsters over here as well. But let's go ahead and mark this. I want to head on down that way. Uh, the problem with all these markings on the map is there's too many markings on the map. For me, anyways. <laughs> too many arrows. Uh, let's get the machete out. And along the way, hopefully we can find some scrap metal. And hopefully no monsters that I can't handle. Private property, keep out. Um, who's going to keep me out? That's the question. Uh, the first thing I want to do, though, it, well, there's mushrooms here. I did take a little bit of a hit here a second ago. Ooh, different kind of mushroom. Edible mushroom found in damp places. All right. Um, are we, am I near where I need to be? Uh, no. Okay, I need to go across that bridge, and there's a fireplace there, which is good. Um, do I want to tear down the sign? Private property? Yeah, let's see what about that. I mean, if there's someone here. <laughs> oh, well. Let's go ahead and light the fire. Getting some XP by doing some tasks. I probably should be looking also for a fishing spot on the way here. Oh, good. The door opens. 
All right, let's try to smash some of the stuff away here. Get some rubber, so you... A bone. I bet you I need that bone to make that... What was a bone hat or something? I think it was a bone hat. But I got rubber. I also got that compass, so once I unlock this or get rid of the monsters on this side of the gate, I'm going to have to get them on, rid of on the other side. Instead of traveling... Or running around all the way to the other side. I can just fast travel to that link tower, I believe. Man, I need to find ceramics. Need to find ceramics. Ooh, okay. Um, I thought I was able to get two hits in before they hit me. No, can you face this way and hit? Thank you. So it's good to find some food on the ground and eat uh, eat it when I can. Can I? All right. So let me go ahead and is it F? I forgot. Is it F to get in here? Yeah. Eat that. Um, five hit points. I thought it doubles my hit points when I eat those. Oh well. Right, I need to go. More this way. We'll gather up some berries. Oh, 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 okay. Well, okay, we're in it now. Well, that's that, that was much easier than when I first ran into one of those, right? <laughs> much easier. Either I'm just getting better at attacking or, of course, all the material that we have helps out. All right, so I think we're at... Oh yeah, a lot of a lot of things here. Um, let's try to eliminate these one at a time. Oh, another one of those guys, huh? Oh wow, there are lots of them here. Yeah, let me let me gather up some more food. <laughs> there are lots of them here. Um. Yeah, maybe I should use like my throwable knives. Man, I would like to get a better angle at these things, but I just can't. All right, he is way over there. Let's come over here and try to. Um, okay, well that might be just too many. All right, well I'm in it now. Okay. Yep. I am glad there is no stamina in the game at this current stage because. I'd be going through it a lot. Nope, I want to get out of that situation. Alright, better. As long as the other dude doesn't come over right now, I am happy with that. Oh, whoops, I thought he was... Nope, nope, no. come on. No, I'm facing the wrong way. Alright, let's, uh, just because, um, hang on a second. 18 hit points? Oh yeah, let me go ahead and eat one of those. What does that get me up to? Full health. Oh, I love berries. I love berries, man. Those are great. Um, yeah, population 143? I don't think so. Yeah, can't damage it with that tool. How about this tool? Can I damage it with that tool? No, I cannot. So, now that this side of the gate is clear, I think it's clear. Uh, no, I'm full. So, let me go ahead and just search the car anyways. Might be something I can grab. No, it is not. Let me get my machete out. I'm just trying to see where that guy went, and I don't know. Alright, so there's no way for me to get to that side. Alright, so, let's see. Uh, how, do, how do I use the compass? Where's the compass? Is the compass here? No, the compass is not there. Um, the compass, this bandage, where, where's the compass? Features. Enables fast travel from one, uh, um, okay, I know that, is that a, tr oh, wait, enables fast travel, from, okay, I know that. This item can only be equipped and, and unequipped at the camp. 
Oh, man. You know what that means? I got to go to a camp. And when I go to the camp, everything's going to respawn. No. I only have two. So trinkets you can only exchange at the camp. Well, ain't that a kick in the head? Well, you know what? Since I've defeated most of the monsters there, I think I am going to go all the way around the fun way. Uh, run around. Yep, time for me to run around. Well, made our way back around to the gate where we took out the first monster. Well, big monster anyway. So yeah, we're, we're pretty much back to Link Towers. But I'm going to go defeat the monsters at the other end. On the way, I found a little fishing spot, gathered, well, caught three fish. So I leveled up just by doing that. I'm going to skip all these monsters here. Don't need to. Um, can I? No, let's go ahead and, and take care of this. <laughs> just because I'm pretty sure it's going to say I cannot open up that gate. Open West Gate, is it going to let me do it? Or is it going to say, no, there's... Yeah, so I got to... Yeah, no problem. Should be able to handle that. All right, leave. I was not far from a campfire, but that means I would have... Oh, okay. okay. Um, I would have to uh, sit at the campfire, put the compass in, and then go defeat all those monsters once again. Now, the one thing I haven't... I, I tried using, <laughs> and I haven't had no luck with it yet is the shovel. I really haven't had uh, where I dug anything and something came up, so I'm not really sure where I need to be using that yet. I have a couple ideas now. I saw a couple patches on the ground. I wonder if I should dig there. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and search that. Interesting. Surprised I haven't searched that yet. Now let's go back and do the relay tower. Open up the gate. A lot of these things I can demolish. I am going to throw these, just throw some stuff into storage. And then once we open this gate, I may set the campfire because now we are at level 9. Open West Gate. Can I do that now? Hello, West Gate. How you doing? Well, that's going to help us out quite a bit. Uh, leave. So, the compass is a trinket, so do I want to lose the hit points and be able to fast travel? I don't think it's really that necessary. Are there ceramics in there? I think there's ceramics in here. Hang on a second here. Yeah, there's ceramics in here. Why? How did I leave all these ceramics behind? Maybe that was early on my tool, my, my weapons didn't damage ceramics? That doesn't seem right. I thought I could damage ceramics in the way in the beginning. Yeah, the sofa we couldn't. Still need to find some more ceramics though so I can upgrade the machete. Uh, the crowbar. Oh, uh, that needs ceramics as well. Surprise, surprise. Ceramics, ceramics, ceramics. I'm trying to think. Is this all the stuff respawning or did I just not tear it down the first time? Let me guess. Didn't tear it down. I thought it said that stuff does not respawn. But the leather, yeah, I need. I'd love to upgrade the backpack to carry, to carry just more things. Remember at one point not long ago, was that last episode? I said, yeah, I don't want to I want to gather any more of this uh, vegetation stuff. And now it seems like I need it for quite a few things. Upgrade damage to 24. Oh, how about if I go to crowbar? Can my crowbar do it? Yep. Yeah, he's just damaging everything, isn't he? Yep, going to town. All right, and the table. No, table, there we go. Is that paper going to stay there on the table? No. Uh, nope, there's a radiator. No, nope, right behind you there. Dude, the radiator. Nope, the radiator. Thank you. Alright, before I set the campfire, throw all that stuff in there. 
Boy, it makes me wonder how when I first started I had a little backpack space, how I went around and did everything, right? <laughs> now I'm just gathering a whole bunch of stuff. But I think lockpicks will help me out quite a bit. I can get more houses. But man, I need to find like a ceramic warehouse or something like that. And I need to probably explore more of the map to maybe unlock some more recipes as well. That'd be good. All right, enough, enough smashing on some things. Let's go. Can I do a fire hydrant? Nah, not yet. I don't know why I want to do it on this fence, but I do. It, it, it's annoying me. So I'm going to take care of it. All right. Gathered up enough material. Let's go throw all that stuff away. Or store it. All right, let's set the campfire. All right, uh, picture two. 10% uh, throwable weapon damage against monsters. It, does, it says against monsters, so... That doesn't count like animals, like deer and stuff like that. 20% uh, experience points gained from storing materials. 50% hit points regained by eating. Total effect, if you pick this, 100% hit points regained by eating. Let's go with experience. I say, I say experience. Alright, so... Trio of perfectly balanced blades thrown out in a cone formation. It needs hide. Uh, I haven't even gathered hide yet. What else did it unlock? I see the bone hat. Needs hide. Uh, sleeping bag uh, needs hide. Cooking stand. I need well, ceramics. Ceramics. I should know that. And that's level 10. Camel netting not so important. Counterweight. Attacks made with a pinpoint accuracy deal more damage. Um, and I need ceramics. So ceramics and hide is really what I need right now. A lot of ceramics and hide. All right, so I have the shovel. Um, upgrade gear. I don't think there's anything I can really upgrade. Bandages I could upgrade. Increase number of uses from two to three. I don't really need bandages really, I don't think. All right, yeah, we're fine. We're only on day four. Seems like it should be a lot longer along than that. But the good news is, now this fence is open. Uh, can I get rid of that waypoint? That's good. Um, yeah, I got some. I got a fishing spot there. Shelter. Oh, there's a quest right here. Oh, I forgot about this quest. Where's my Where's my machete, please? The quest that uh, I had a hard time doing last time. Uh, I, my crowbar can take care of this. I just want to remove this in case I need to run away. Run away, fool. Run away. Alright, well, we'll accept this. Alright. Oh, I thought I was going to dodge that, but apparently not. Throw, throw. Alright, now I just have to deal with them. And now one. Oh, will you just hit him? I know this is a time limit. Oh, come on. All right. Complete. Thank you. Give me that 3,000 XP. Uh, took some a lot of damage there that I did not need to take, but I took it. I took it like a man. Sit down. I just need to gather up some food and I can heal myself. I mean, I could try the bandages. What What is the bandage? No, wrong button. Uh, is the bandages under specialty items? They are. Restores 50% of maximum hit points. Let's go ahead and put that in there. Why does it say zero in there? This is zero uses... Zero of two. Do I have to actually, I have to craft bandages and then put them in there? Well, that kind of sucks. 
Yep, I can't. I don't have any bandages to bandage myself. All right, uh, let me go back in there. So that's kind of weird. I thought I was gonna. I thought it was that. Uses I replenish that camp. I was at camp. Oh, because it wasn't in. It wasn't in the um, the bar. So I went back to camp. It didn't replenish them. Same thing with the monster lures, I guess. All right. Uh, let me try these pain meds. That restores a lot of HP. A lot of HP. So that's not too bad, I suppose. So if you don't have food on you, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and throw all that stuff back into here. All right. So what do I want to do next? Well, yeah. Ceramics and hives is what we're really after. Um... Yeah, I need lock picks for this kind of stuff. And the next relay tower is here. How do I get there is the question. Is there a wall here? Let's let's head out this way. There's going to be some monsters here that I need to smash. Question is, I didn't see if there was a wall there or not. Oh, okay. All the other monsters on the other side of the wall are now coming. Yeah, so I can see we're level 11. Upgrading to where the monsters don't respawn would be kind of nice. But like I said, you do get material from them, so I, you know, it's kind of like a, uh, a win-lose kind of a thing. Can we... I, I searched this car before. I know I did. Whatever. All right, let's gather up the material that I had here from before. Um, the one thing I want to put in, I keep hitting tab to do that. Uh, let's get rid of the fishing pole and put in the shovel. Can I go this way? Is the question. What the heck is that? Okay. Yeah, and I'm supposed to get hide somehow. Whoa, hello. Oh, one of you, huh? Alright, so wait, where's... He's after the deer. Neither one of us can hit anything. Ouch! I went back too quick. Alright, so... <laughs> I mean, I guess throwing knives at deer might be something, but... Yeah, I'm not too sure about that. Not too sure about that at all. Unless I can corner the deer somewhere and get some hide, but I'm only going to get like one hide. If they kill the deer, do I get the chance to... Yeah, can we work together? What the heck was that noise? Might have been just because they were running away. They were out of range and it sounded kind of weird. Yeah, give me some more rubber. I don't know where they went. Not at all. Uh, yeah, so I am around. So let's go ahead and see if I can get my way over to this link relay. Uh, the one to my right. That way. While I'm here, I'm going to gather up some food. Oh no! My inventory my inventory is full. Why would it be full? Why does that have to be full? Um, yeah, even my character is scratching his head. Alright, we'll just leave it there. Just leave it there. What is this? Uh, gather that. I know I can't, but I'm going to go ahead and pop it up so I can see it there later on. Let's go ahead and read the sign. Maybe there'll be a campfire over here somewhere. Oh, hello. There we go. Ow! That hurt, dude.
here. That was unfair. Is there a campfire here? The unfinished house. No, I can't hit that. I would love... Let's get the map out. Any... No, it's not showing me a campfire nearby. All right, that's fine. All right, no sense of smashing things here as of now because I don't have the room for it. Um... Oh, it's got one of those things. I'm not sure if I'm ready to fight one of those. All right, I need I need some uh, hit points. Let me go ahead and take one of these pain beds. All right, and let's go ahead and... You know what? We're going to drop those. And we're going to eat that. There we go. Now we're all set. I'm going to leave that plastic there. Uh, ceramics. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I just saw... <laughs> I did not see him standing there. Hello, sir. How are you today? Is there a campfire here? Uh, there's a time chest. Are you going to tell me there's no campfires? Did I find... Because I said I found 10 of 10, but I'm assuming there's more. But you know what happens when you assume... Uh, you know what I need to do? Let me get my throwing knives out. Uh, you want to throw that again? Because I don't really use my throwing knives often. I don't think it'll be too hard to defeat this guy, but if I got the knives, let's go ahead and use them. And I think I'm done with knives. Now you come out here. Ouch. This guy's got some acid reflex problems, I think. I'm just saying. Hey, you got me there. Can you can you come out in the open, dude? He's a little bit different than he was. There we go. That's a new monster slain? That's not the same thing as what I, what, what I did at the gate before? Hmm. Tomatoes. Carrots and corn. Oh my. Okay, so there's a time chest. So we know the time chest. You gotta do it from a campfire. Why do I feel like there's gonna be some new stuff here that I have not... Yeah, a long time ago. Uh, look, can I damage it with this? Try to hide it? I don't think they tried to hide it. I wasn't too impressed with the last crate that we found. That sounded like I was breaking glass. Yeah, a whole bunch of material everywhere. All right, so we're trying to go over to this rink le relay, which is over here. I really would like to find the campfire, though. Ceramics. Uh, pick lock. Oh, no. Okay, well. No, get the, get the machete. There you go. Uh, all right, well, you know. Two's company, three's a crowd. Oh, wow. Are they getting faster or am I just getting slower? <laughs> Boy, do I need a campfire. Oh, a cafe with tons of ceramics. Oh, uh, where's my campfire? I need to unload some of this stuff. Uh, wait, I see a campfire on the map. I see a campfire on the map. Oh, wait, no, it's this way. Eleven of thirty-five. Well, hello, campfires. 
So the ceramic jackpot we found for now, it seems like I hit it, but I might find it later on. Uh, no, get the crowbar out for that. So I know we need the ceramics for a lot of stuff. But man, I gotta find a way to get leather. Let's go ahead and try to gather all the stuff that we can in here. Come on over back over to here. So I can upgrade the machete. And not enough for the crowbar. Hmm. I say we upgrade the machete. Is that the wise thing to do? I mean, that's like, like my main attacking tool, right? Come at me, dude. Uh, wait. No, I wasn't ready for you yet. Hang on a second. I don't like fighting in tight spaces with you. Is he coming? If he's not coming, I'm not going to worry about it. No, he's not coming. Don't forget it. Forget it. Let's leave him alone. Let's go ahead and listen to the radio, though. Special message for the dear inhabitants of Capernaum. Your mighty walls will keep the monsters at bay. Sleep tightly. You are safe and loved. This is an automated recording sent from K23, the Crown Station. Well, I don't know where this Crown Station is, but, um... Yeah, they're not really helping us out at all. And remember, I think we were in our bunker for years, right? the heck was making that noise? Let's close that door. The heck was that? Wheat. Hello, wheat. So I'm not learning any recipes. Uh, my crowbar should be able to handle this. You might be saying, Peter, just go up, upgrade your, your cro uh, machete and you should be able to do fine on some of this stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me gather up some materials here. Actually, I think I'm full of materials. Alright, uh, let's get out of here, kind of. Hang on a second. No, I can't gather anymore. Got that room for ceramics. Alright, let's come over here. Yeah, I don't, I don't see a crafting bench anywhere. Might be a whole bunch of stuff in there, but let's go ahead and set the campfire. Whole bunch of experience there. Um, upgrade gear. Machete. Perfect. Do I have enough for the crowbar still? Uh, I actually have enough ceramics. I don't have enough iron. Go figure that out. Go figure that out. Uh, oh, so I got to craft. No, I can upgrade bandages. I don't want to upgrade bandages. Uh, throwing knives. That takes ceramics. Uh, cooking pot. No, I don't want to upgrade the cooking pot. Inventing craft. I want to come into here. I kind of forgot. Um, ceramics. Okay, I don't have enough ceramics to do the cooking stand. All right. Now, I don't really care about getting a cooking stand. There's plenty of cooking areas around here. Event and craft items. Can, okay, so I can't really say. I think someone says I like to sleep overnight, but uh, yeah, what well, uh, the nighttime is not bad as far as I'm concerned. Um, but, you know, I want to try everything out in this game anyways as, it, as we come along across it. But we got the upgraded machete now. All right, so I think it's this way we want to go. Let me get the machete out. Um, oh yeah, wait, wait. Okay, yeah, wait. Hang on a second. A lot more damage, which is good. Yeah, we'll go ahead and all right. I'll take you on as well because I can. Oh, I forgot about all that stuff over there. Oh, 25 seconds ago. Okay, I, I hang on a second. All right, we got to do this. Got to sit at the campfire. Leave the campfire. And run, dude. Don't 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 care about the monsters. Uh, okay, that one didn't even see me for some reason. Locked two seconds ago. You got to be kidding me. All right, so... Being able to run faster may come in handy 
with a coffee thermos. And I'm getting stuck on things I don't even see there, which is just great. Well, a whole bunch of lead and leather. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just come back. I don't care if I take a little bit of damage right now. Well, I do, but... That was rude, man. That was really, really rude. All right, I want to come in here and gather all this stuff up. Oh, he's back. Hang on a second. No, no, I don't want to fight you right now. All right, let's go throw all that stuff in there. Um, I can upgrade the crowbar and the machete again. Uh, yeah, we're going to upgrade the machete and regain some health. How about that upgrade gear? Um, mm -hmm. And wait, can I upgrade? I don't think I can upgrade the crowbar at all. Low on... No, I said crowbar. Yeah, up, low on all that. Man, why, does this, why does it keep flickering back and forth on me? So hide. Yeah, need to hide. We know that. All right. So machete again. All right, now what I want to do is get my shovel out. This little thing right here, can I dig that? So I've been seeing these marks on the ground, so yeah, I haven't been able to find a use for the shovel yet. All right, let me get my, no, not the shovel. We need to go un unlock this relay tower, which is up here somewhere. Is it, am I, am I going the right direction? Yes, I am. Yes, we are. I'll go around you. Grab some mushrooms. And it's over there. Over here, over, the, over there. Am, am I, do I really get stuck on bushes like this? Or is there something underneath there? No, I'm getting stuck on those bushes. All right, so it looks like I need to go through that yard. Gimme. All right, uh, where is my way in here? Uh, oh, well, I can't go that way. All right, um, I mean, that's fine. <laughs> I forgot he was in there. I forgot he was in there. Yeah, 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 one more into the fray. Uh-huh. All right. All right, so now I'm trying to find a back way into this thing. So if I want to deal with one of these things, maybe I can do that. Hmm. <laughs> no, I still got to go into, I guess, I don't know if you want to call it the graveyard or. I didn't dismantle that, but that's fine. Only... Oh, I leveled up. How did I level up that much? Must have been a lot of XP to do that. All right, so there is only one way in, and that's the way I went before, apparently. All right, snuck in without being seen. Let's go ahead and activate this radar here. Perfect. So th the best thing about this is right now it's activated, right? So what could have happened here? I don't know. I can't read it. Nothing to read. I don't want to hit nothing because, well, yeah, I got I got these dudes out here. Where where is where is this guy? 
See if I can get back out of here. Where did he go? All right, so he's he's there. Let's let him make his rounds. And we'll sneak back out of here. <laughs> Just get out of here. Uh, I want to go back to the campfire, but I want to make sure I can keep everything that I have. All right, so there's one. Where is, I forgot where this guy is. Where He should be making his rounds somewhere. There he is. I guess this is where the throwable items would really come in handy because I could take them on down. Alright, so we are out. Alright, so I'm going to gather us a little bit more material. We'll go back to the campfire, see what level 10 allows us to do, if anything. Creature's sure going to also do something, but we know le level 11 is a lot of main things that we can, uh, we can go ahead and unlock. Actually, there's some ceramics over here, I think. Well, it beat the crap out of a lot of things. Let's go ahead and store the stuff away. And really, it's all about being level 10. Let's get some skill points. Uh, Multi-talented fisher. Unexperienced points gained from fishing. We get a lot of experience from fishing. I won't lie on that. 10% uh, throwable weapon damage against monsters. Yes, I know about that. Choose between four skills instead of three when leveling up. Yeah, I still have a hard time figuring out what I want to level up with. Um, hmm. I think throwable items might be next. But it's only against monsters, not against animals. Uh, this could come crucial. Let's go ahead and unlock that. Invent and craft. Um, yeah, I don't have leather to do the hat yet. Uh, fishing. Tackle. Attracts fish quicker than a simple hook would. 75% fishing speed, which is not too bad. I don't have the iron for that. Yeah, uh, we don't have the... We knew about this, the Shiv Trio. I don't have no hide. Yeah, gotta work on the hide. The counterweight, the coffee mug, that we know about. Uh, the lock pick. Yep. Uh, common compressor. The heck is that? Doubles the backpack slot carry capacity for common materials. Um, yes. <laughs> Doubles the pack backpack slot carrier. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna look pretty good. Uh, Link tower toolkit. I forgot what that does. Uh, oh yeah, so I can't. I forgot what it does. But level eleven is gonna do a lot of things. I gotta make sure I have this. Uh, it looks like electronics and uh, metal. Uh, the cooking stand. Do I have enough to make that? No, I'm short on ceramics. Surprise, surprise. Uh, so leather and ceramics is what's really holding me back a little bit. But man. Um, yeah, the leather. I'm not quite sure. So hopefully now with the up, I, yeah, it's not going to help me. It says against monsters, not against, not against animals. But we do have two more of the relays undone. Uh, the other two relays, one is over here. But I think next episode we'll come over here, get the link tower unlocked, uh, get this relay undone. Where is the other? Wait, I've done three relays. Yeah, so I got one more relay. Okay, so that's not too bad. So next episode, yeah, let's go. We'll go over this link tower, unlock that, and then take care of this arena obelisk. I don't remember looking at that, um, but then hopefully we can come over and maybe. I don't want to leave the island. I don't know if, if leave the if escape the island was our main goal. I don't want to escape the island if that ends the game. I want, I'd rather sit around and have some more fun with the game. Um, but doubles the backpack capacity. I don't know if it doubled the backpack capacity or not. I have no idea. No, that's the wrong button. Yeah, so two items. So now when I gather two leaves, it only takes up one slot. It used to be one leaf for one slot. Now it's two leaves take up one slot. Uh, wrong tool. I just want to check this out here. So we get one scrap. Yeah, so one scrap does not fill up one full bar in here. That is going to be very, very handy. Very, very handy indeed. But what I think I'm going to do in between episodes is go around and gather up some materials. I, I may try to kill a couple of deer and try to get some, some high. That's going to be kind of crucial to upgrade a lot of stuff that we have. Um, yeah, but next episode, yeah, we're going to, we're going to get the, uh, the graveyard relay done, the other link tower unlocked. Try to get to level 11. And I think 
pretty much I would like to I guess at this point also be able to unlock to where the monsters don't respawn every time I go to a fire that'll make it somewhat easier to travel around but I'm not sure if I want to I'll have to think about that uh, kind of hard actually but that is going to do it for today guys hope you guys did enjoy the episode I do appreciate you watching as always I'll catch you next time right here in Dismantle but until then have a good one